got it through. Penetrator here. We're off to a blocked drain. That's right. We're off to a blocked stormwater. So this is a brand new home that's been built and the builder didn't do this work. The owner got in some other contractors to do the outside al fresco dining area and some concreting around the outside of the house. Since that extra work has been done, having problems with stormwater not draining. Uh, they believe something's been tipped down there, either a concrete slurry mix or some tile grout or, or something along the lines of that. So we'll go out there and check it out and see if we can get it all flowing. Right up, I'll see you when I get there. So I'm out here at this property. It's a new house and um, Things were working okay, and then the homeowners got in some contractors to do the al fresco at the back and the concreting around the side. Since then, um, this stormwater has not been working. It just fills up here and just floods, creates a massive swimming pool through this area. He contacted the builder. Uh, I think the builder said, speak to the other con contractors because they weren't part of the, they've come in after. Uh, Concrete came out and pulled out some stuff and said that was um, tile and glue. But there is a problem. From that tin there of paint to that yellow marker, through there, I can't get my camera. So is it going to be full of concrete slurry? Or oh, well, they've been tipping something down here? Oh, I don't know yet, but it's looking that way. So let's fire up the jet see if we can get it all cleared. Flick the camera up here. I couldn't quite get a picture of what it was, but I do think it's more slurry. It looks like the bottom of the pipe is filled with a slurry. I can't push past there. So let's have a look. We've got to go back up that way.
and we just ran out of water. <laughs> we got far enough. Looks concrete slurry-ish. If that's even a word? Probably not, but I've invented it if it is. And we're gonna roll with it, slurry-ish. Um, need this to fill up. And we might send the reverse up and around and see if we can pull stuff down to here and then shoot it towards the street. That's gonna be the plan. Little single barrel, we'll send this up towards the back of the house and start pulling some of this stuff out and get it out to the street. for the downpipes, that's what it feels like it may have done. So yeah, we shoot up junctions, but that's all good, we're right at the end, so we're fine.
do roofing screws down there. I'm gonna go from the other end and just start pushing it out. We're gonna go from here towards the street. Forward shooting, cutting, pushing, sending it all towards the street and see what comes out at the at the end. And we 
ran out of water. Couple bits of pipe. We're out of water. <laughs> so. Do you need a water access? No, no, I've got, it needs to fill up, mate. It's not enough pressure here to keep up with it. That's all. What's that, sorry? I'm saying it's fascinating, I've never seen this before. Yeah, no, it is pretty interesting, right? So, I think this area from where I marked them was full of, like, your slurry or something. They've tipped something down here, washed something down here. Yeah. It's gone both ways up the pipe and set. So, I've had the nozzle from that point there yeah. up to the back, yeah. and I've pulled everything through to there, oh. and I put a different nozzle on here to start pushing it down. Oh, okay. So once I get that through, most of it should be gone. There's a few little bits scattered around. That's okay. that's fine. And you just don't want big chunks. Yeah. All right. I was say thank no you worries, mate. Way. Just need this to fill up, and I'll keep yeah. it working. Yeah. yeah, you can see a little bit. Most of it's probably gone down there, but I'll keep a little bit of the evidence so they can look at it. Maybe it is something from the patio area. Let's just flush this last section and just pull out some of the stuff that's here. Some roofing screws here. Take a photo. Easier to send. But there's like lots. Lots of photos. <laughs> This is just because the pipe doesn't have enough fall. Oh, it's okay. pretty. Okay. It's clear. It's just, and it's common, but they don't give it fall. But yeah, it, it's just someone's tipped something most likely down that grate or we'll washed something down there, and it's just set in this gully of water. Yeah. Now we come out of it around the corner. GoPro just died, or, or I turned it off or something, but I just blasted all this stuff out of that pipe. Put the reverse on, some big rocks, got a heap of those screws out. 
Okay, let's pack up. So all our caps are back on. The problem was located around this area. I believe there, it would have been some sort of slurry or something to do with the tiling because there's a belly of water from that stretch around to here. And if they've just tipped it down there, it's just gave it time to set. So right up, we're all done here. Everything's done. If I've missed anything, that was because the um, camera, GoPro, battery died. Right up, see you on the next one.